think I've ever done. Right, go. Good morning, everybody. Let's do files from school today because I'm at work. I hope that's all right. Are you ready? Now then, I've got a helper helping me to tape. If you want to point the camera to the letters, is that all right? Okay. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, U, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my A, B, C. Won't you come and have a cup of tea? That was nice. Now. We're going to start today by practicing the sounds that we have already learned this week. So let's start with this one. And this one. Well done. Now we're going to have a little look at our friendly sounds, the two sounds together to make one phony. Are you ready? Oh. Well done. I'm just going to get my whiteboard and pen now because I've got some sounds at my house that aren't on the board. Oh, hold on a minute. I think I've just spotted one. Do you remember yesterday's phony? And this one. Down here. Do you remember who this lady is? She's the queen. And this sound is the qu, qu, qu. Well done. So we're going to start by writing our tricky words. Here, we've got I, to, into, no, the, and go. We'll start by finding the words that we learned yesterday. And we're going to put them on the king of the penguins. So we've got me, I'll move that one for now. And we've got we. Oops. And we've got B. And we've got he. So we're going to start by writing those words. Are you ready? Up tall, down, and over a little hill. Yeah. Huh. E makes an E sound. He. Mm. E. Me. Next one. B. E. B. And what? E. We. We're going to put another word on the king of the penguins today. And here it is. The word is she. The s and the h go together to make the sh sound. I'm going to learn that one tomorrow. I've put it right up there on the king of the penguins. I'm going to add it on the bottom of my list. Sh e. And I'm going to put sound buttons on this word because we've got a friendly sound. There we go. Have a go. Make sure your letters are cursive. And I like a nice list. Now then, we'll learn a new sound. And I'm going to tell you a story about this sound, because you'll never believe it. Mr Kirkwood has bought me a present. It's very exciting. I'll show it you now. Are you ready? It's very heavy. Oh, it's a diamond ring. It's a very, very heavy diamond ring, because the diamond is so big. I can hardly lift my hand. And here's the action. Ing, ing. Ng. And I'm going to show you that ng. Now, here it is. Get it off the board. Ng. It's that ng and a k together as friends to make the ng phony. It's a new friendly sound. So, we're going to use the ng on a phony in frame. Are you ready? Let me get my board ready. Oh, wrong side. One, two lights. Going down. Are you ready? The first word is ring. Let's rub our arms it. R, I, N, G. So, up, down, and halfway over the hill. I, and 
that's right. Ng at the end. Be careful to put both the sounds in the same part of your phoneme frame. Ring. Mr. Kirkwood has bought me a ring. The next word. We're only going to change one sound. So I'll tell you the word and then I want you to see if you can guess which sound is going to change. So we're going to change ring and we're going to make it say sing. Let's rub our arms in. I can hear it's the first sound. What are we going to change it to? That's right. Well done. From that everything, we'll have a little go at sound buttons. The new word is king. So we need a kicking cut for king. Up top, down, a big fat tummy and a kicking leg. K. I. Do you remember how to put your sound buttons on? It's very important. K. I. Ng. King. Well done. Our sentence today. Turn your board over. Oh, we're ready. Remember your finger spaces and keep your letters sitting on the line. I don't want to see them floating all over your board. So concentrate. Are you ready? First word. He. Capital K because it's the first letter in our sentence. He. Finger space. Is. That's an easy peasy word. It's only got two sounds. It's. He is. A. Even easier. Only one. I'm going to go underneath because I haven't got a space. He is a king. K. I. Ng. Here we are. So I'm going to be back later. We're going to do forest schools. We're going to be making a bog baby and I'm going to show you how to make a bubble wand. We're going to have lots of fun this afternoon. I'll see you later. Bye bye.